Where we go? We're going to the Oricon waterfall. With Yellow Dog. With Yellow Dog, duh. Gotta have Yellow Dog. Gotta have Yellow Dog. He just decided to come with us to the waterfall. I'm so happy. Me too. Yeah, that is a lot bigger than I thought. Yeah. So we're here at the Ohun waterfall, uh, just uh, about one kilometer from our base camp, and it's uh, much bigger than I thought it was going to be. Very cool. Mongolia uh, never ceases to amaze, that's for sure. Okay, so it's the last night here at the uh, the lake camp. I guess that's the best way I can describe it. I uh, had been riding horses, and we're doing something a little bit different tonight for dinner. We're actually preparing our dinner, or watching them prepare our dinner. Lots of meat. So let's check it out. Baggy, oh, yes. baggy. How you yeah. doing? Yeah. This tasty dish is called ho 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 hawk ho hawk Oh God, you know what? It's called a traditional Mongolian barbecue, and it's made with mutton, vegetables, and piping hot stones. The ingredients are layered, and then the cook pours in water, covers the dish, and lets the steam do the rest. It's said that this dish is to cure fatigue, and after four days of riding horses over a mountain pass, it couldn't have come at a better time. After about an hour, Manuel brought in our meal, and the sizzle and smell that filled the gear all added to the experience. That night, we ate like nomads. This is the good life. Wow, you can see the stones wow. right there. There are the stones. No, right no, there. don't stop. It's hot. Ah. Yeah, it's hot. But it's very good for fatigue. Fatigue, okay? Yeah, after four days horseback riding, everybody is exhausted. It's yeah. for fatigue. Yeah. Oh. Both hands. So, I had some potatoes, but I had some of this, mutton, and uh, some magnifique. <laughs> amazing, amazing. Does everybody like it? C'est bon. C'est bon. How do you say it? Very good. Very delicious. Very delicious. Mashroi. 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 Yes, thank you. assholes cut us off. So now we're gonna try to get ahead of them. Good job, Mano. Good job, Mano. Yeah. <laughs> Screw those guys. <laughs> So it's officially day 11, and uh, we're just a few uh, minutes outside of uh, our base camp back at the Eight Lakes where we're riding horses, and we're gonna head to the hot spring, which is uh, only about five hours drive from here, I believe. We're all excited too, because that means we get to shower and bathe, and I haven't done that in a while, so yeah. Not feeling good today, Lenny? No? Yeah, I don't know what's going on here, but uh, one by one we've been getting sick. So yeah, that sucks. Uh, Lenny's not feeling very well today. First it was Guillaume, then uh, Cher, then Carolyn, and now Lynn. I don't know what's happening. It's like everyone's getting sick uh, one at a time. Hopefully not me, but uh, wow, yeah. 
Anyway, day 11 off to kind of a rocky start. Hopefully it'll be like uh, Carolyn just one day mm -hmm. and then gone. Yeah. That'd be the road and... Uh, I think the road yeah. too. The road and the yeah. dust probably doesn't help. No, it doesn't help. I'm hoping it's not food related. Yeah, me neither. It'll be good. Uh, yeah. Just need one day. A day of rest. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> uh. Uh. Hi, Bat Oh, is this secret? <laughs> yeah. So this is how you're making lunch in the back of uh, the van. That's yeah, very impressive. Yeah, this is all, almost my life. It's <laughs> <laughs> almost your. <laughs> yeah. This is my kitchen room. Your kitchen. Yeah, I like sometimes it. Sometimes I sleep in here. <laughs> <laughs> very good. Yeah. Very cool. <laughs> let me out. Let me out. Oh, okay. That's easy. job except me I just film everything Just when you think you're feeling a little bit overwhelmed at the bumpiness of these roads, uh, Badman just kind of uh, gave us a reality check because she said when it rains, these roads are just 10 times worse, which is hard to imagine. They go around three times clockwise, toss a stone. Good luck on the journey. And it's starting to rain slightly. Son of a bitch. <laughs> when we heard we were going to the hot springs, we began to conjure up thoughts of a rustic spa complete with fluffy towels and most important of all, a hot shower. But as we rolled up to camp, reality quickly set in. There would be no monogrammed bathrobes or free massages. Where is the hot tub? <laughs> no se. No, no lo se. se. You alright, Lenny? Yeah. That was a rough day and it looks like we uh, drove past the nicest looking part of town and ended up here on the outskirts. Maybe the hot tub is inside the girl. Yeah, that'd be cool. <laughs> Welcome to Mongolian Paradise. Uh. Welcome. Welcome. Not. The rain clouds started closing in as we piled into our gears, but it really didn't matter since it soon became apparent that there wasn't much else to do here except to rest up for the next day of driving. Oh, you go to hot speed, eh? The source of the Poor spring. Lady. There's yeah. nothing to see, Dad. There's nothing, nothing to see? Just the Sweet. No, We're here and there's no nothing one. to see. But it's 86 degrees. 86? 86. Holy cow. 86. 86. Okay, so I'm here checking out the uh, facilities. We were uh, hoping for a hot shower, and it looks like they do have shower facilities here. Unfortunately, it's communal shower facilities, but hey, you know, it's all good. Got a couple sinks and actual uh, Western-style toilets. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. I mean, I haven't uh, seen hot water or Western-style style toilet in a couple weeks, so it's kind of nice. Uh, right here is the hot tub. There's no roof. There's no roof. No, man, there needs to be a roof when it starts raining. I can? Yeah, go for it. Oh. Warm? No. <laughs> so tonight? Tonight? I don't know, man. Where? I don't know. Maybe, maybe. There's no roof, though. What if it starts raining? C'est la vie. C'est la vie. Crazy French people. A bar in there, warm place to hide, 
Yeah, I it's locked. But it's closed, it's closed. I feel my first world problems acting up. Don't mean to be a whiny dick or anything, but uh, I was expecting something a little bit more uh, usable. Because I don't have any type of swimsuit or whatever, so if I'm going to shower, I'm going to just basically be showering in front of whoever decides to take, take a peek and walk in or whatever. So, hot tub I don't really care about, but shower, damn. Yeah, welcome to the hot springs. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So after uh, 20 minutes of surfing on razor sharp uh, volcanic rocks, I made it to the bottom of the crater, so we're at about 70 meters in depth.